everybody, this Sunday we are meeting 9.30 a.m. and I would encourage you to be reading ahead in Luke's Gospel. We're in chapter 9. We're going to be looking at uh, Luke 9, 18 to 62. We'll finish off chapter 9 and we're going to come to the incredible story of the transfiguration of Jesus where he takes Peter and James and John and they go up the mountain and there uh, with Jesus they see him transfigure before their eyes and they just see him emanating light. And it's amazing as you read it because I often think this, you know, the amazing thing about the transfiguration is not that Jesus transformed in front of them and that, you know, they saw a glimpse of his power and his deity. The amazing thing is that his human frame ever hid that reality of who he was. And so he's up there and you probably know the story. Moses and Elijah appear with him. Moses represents, of course, the law in the Old Testament. Elijah represents the prophets. And Peter, James, and John have uh, their ears tuned in and they listen to Jesus with, with Moses and Elijah discussing his departure, his exodus, speaking of his death. And it's amazing that in that discussion, they talked about his death as an exodus, as a you know, leaving one place and arriving at another, going from this life into eternity. That's what was going to happen at the death of Jesus on the cross, that he was going to participate in eternal life and be resurrected from the dead. And, you know, what's amazing is that for Peter, this discussion, I think the memory of this discussion changed his whole view of death for himself because even in the, his writings in Second Peter uh, chapter 1, he spoke about when his exodus would come, when his departure would happen. And uh, 2 Peter chapter 1, verse 15. And I'm just encouraged by that because to think about how our hope in Christ and who Jesus is changes our whole perspective on death, on what life is, and on the hope that we have in Christ. So this Sunday, we're going to just take a look at that as we look at the rest of uh, Luke chapter 9. We'll be looking forward to our time Together, we hope to see you here at 930. God bless you.